about the difference. We got this YouTube video going on, and I like to show like all of my games. That's all I'm doing right now. You got combined Rob's games in there, my games in there. Just want you to see it. First of all, I just want to let you know that I'm the tag team motherfucking champion of the world. You see that shit shining, okay? We got Left 4 Dead 2. Got the Xbox controller, and I got my little little pad, okay? Yes, you do. You see a wave bird right there, and you see this Halo controller. Look at that limited edition. Then you got this little limited edition Chrome Xbox controller. You got the red, and you got the Target controller. Then you got your Wii U games, your Wii U control pad. You got your tablet. You got your Super Smash Brothers, Skies of Arcadia for the GameCube, Tomb Raider, Batman. All that shit, okay? And we just gotta make a video. What, no love for the Vita? Oh, and the Vita. I did not see the Vita. I, probably, yep. I, I seen the thing, but we got the Vita in there. And my 3DS is on the ground. Okay, this is gonna be a long video, and we finna just, just go in. I guarantee we go in like 80% of the time. Microsoft, we finna get in your motherfucking ass. I can tell you that right now. Oh, we the anti-Microsoft right now. Oh, I'm anti-Microsoft. Microsoft now I just want to let y'all know. One too many, and this right here is just the last straw. I play video games, okay? You're looking at this table, you can see it. I play motherfucking video games. This is why. I'm going to put it to you guys like this as this, well. This, Simple uh, as that. These are all, what? Used. What, video games? Oh, they're, they're used because we play them, but hey. Exactly. Shit, we use the fuck out of You want to play Left 4 Dead? But I, I just want to show you guys. You you, hey, you so-called video game players. Hey, hey. You want to borrow my heavy ring? Oh, oh yeah, I would love to do that. Here, here, here. Oh, sharing is caring. That's all right. And then I can give it right back to you. You oh, don't have thanks. to pay for it. Oh, shit. I don't have to pay for it. It's Holy crazy. No. But I, I want to show no. you, you so-called video game players. You so-called video game players. Look at my video. Look at the games on here. Look at these. Look at these games. It's a complete mix. A complete mix of genre. It's not just okay. one but basic look, genre. Look at the video games on here. Look at the video games. Look at this shit. Look at them. Let's go in there. There's, oh, there's more. I got games. There's a lot more. I got Jesus games. Rob right got here. games. But I do you guys games. notice two games that you fake video games players that you fake video game players have? Madden and Call of Duty. They are not on the table. Nope. I don't know why you guys spend six hundred dollars on a fucking video game system to play these games that you could do in real no, life. No, Go to a gun sense. range. No sense. Go play flag football with your friends. Go play mm -hmm. basketball in real life. You two K back. You guys, you guys fake. You can't play the fucking shit. And you know why we play this? Because there ain't nowhere in the world that you go see me fighting the fucking dragon in real life. <laughs> <laughs> play some skies of Arcadia. It's impossible. But it's video games, okay? Just flat, flat out video games. Right, before y'all say anything about anybody being a fucking fanboy, we get into it before we get into Microsoft's ass. Anybody being a fanboy, I just want just let you know. Left 4 Dead and Left 4 Dead 2 are my favorite games I ever played in my life. I, I haven't I've yet played a video game better than that. And if anything, was second close to that, it's straight up Pokemon. Okay. Oh, I don't know about that one because you also have the new game that's a Microsoft exclusive called uh, what's that new zombie game called? State of Decay. State of Decay. That's pretty State nice. Of Decay. That's pretty nice. That's a, that's that's a, a good, good game. game. Yeah, yeah. It should have been an MMO though. It should have. But um, unfortunately, they're rooting for the wrong team right now. Yeah, they. You know, they unfortunately, wish. when they release that MMO version, it's gonna be on a, uh, Xbox One. And guess one. who won't be buying it? Unfortunately, not. Well, yeah, obviously. Okay, we don't need the Xbox One, um, according to these dumbass PR agents from Microsoft that go on Twitter and go on TV and shit and say that if you don't learn to play online games, you want to use these games, you did, that's what we made the 360 for. So y'all motherfuckers need to bring games like Rise on the 360 because I'm not buying an Xbox One. Nobody's buying that yeah, bullshit. That is center. I, I'm letting my money do the talk in this generation. We got, and and uh, don't, don't, don't bullshit me, my Microsoft. And all you guys are, oh, you cheap, you cheap, you you get what you pay for, we, we, we. fuck that. I got AT&T U-verse right now. I can log on to any one of my systems online and pop on this PlayStation Vita. We just finished watching a YouTube video on the PlayStation Vita right now. Pop on anything I can turn on my Wii U right now and get online. And, I'll, and I can get on Xbox One online if I want to. It's the principality that the fact that if I went to Las Vegas and wanted to take my Xbox 360, which I doubt I'd be in Vegas playing the Xbox, but I'm just saying, <laughs> if I went to Vegas, because you know they charge like $14 a day for the internet, 
If I went to Vegas and wanted to play my game, okay, I should be able to not without play my game without checking into Mommy. I don't have time for that bullshit. Nope. It's, a, but it's, it's called video games. Video games. Microsoft, you just don't understand. Video games. Okay? Not Call of Duty. Okay? I don't give a fuck about Call of Duty. It seems like that's what you guys are basing your stuff off of. Call of Duty and Madden and, and Activision and EA. Run you guys' lives. Those aren't fucking video games. You can go do that shit in real life. Go to a shooting range. Go out in the woods and go shoot some shit. So go paintballing. Or go paintballing. Shit. Now, see, here's the thing, right. now, Call of Duty, Call of Duty, man, they're all cool games and everything, but it's not something to just base your, just base your console sale off of as well. Yes, there's Call of Duty and there's Mad, but there's also great ass fucking multiplayer games that I see hella people hating on. For instance, Left 4 Dead. A lot of people will sit there and judge that based off of the fact that they played Call of Duty and the fact that Left 4 Dead doesn't play like Call of Duty, they'll say it's a sorry ass game. Uncharted, Killzone, any game altogether. It can be Gears of War and because of the fact that it's not like Call of Duty, it sucks to them. And that shouldn't even be the case altogether. Little kids play Call of Duty, that's how I feel. Um, I but, it's, I mean, just getting into like Left 4 Dead and you Xbox fanboys, okay? Because I, I, I like video games. Don't, don't call me a fanboy for anything. If I was going to be a fanboy for anything, it's yeah, Nintendo. Nintendo. The motherfuckers innovating. I'm going to get into that shit in a minute. Left 4 Dead is not an Xbox exclusive. You can buy that shit on the on PC. The Just wanted to inform you idiots about that shit. So don't even try and throw that as your exclusive. You guys don't have no fucking exclusives. All you got is Halo and, and Gears of War. So don't even yeah, try and do that bullshit. Dead, man. After that shit, uh, the judgment was a shame. Judge, I, no, like, so was Ascension, though. At the I, same time. Ascension no, wasn't. Uh, not no, really. No. It wasn't bad at all. Multiplayer-wise, it was terrible. Uh, I don't play games for multiplayer, though. That's the problem. Not really it's the, it's, not, it's always been a single-player game. And that's why I enjoy about it. And, and not only that, but the game, before they did the little bullshit patch, the game went to real gamers because the shit was hard as fuck with the uh, Trial of Archelaus or whatever the hell that shit is. is that, that part was hella hard. Just letting you know that. But they patched it and made it easy, so it is what it is. But, um, no. God of War, not God of War, Gears of War, Judgment, Microsoft, or who, who make you guys? Who make Gears of War? I don't even know. Y'all y'all know y'all. Yeah. Y'all know y'all put out some bullshit. You know you put out some bullshit. That game had to been the worst game I ever spent $60 on in my life. I, I, like, I, I tried my hardest to play that game. And GameStop, I'm not trading y'all shit. I'm not giving y'all shit. I'm getting y'all ass in a minute too. I'm not trading y'all shit. Let's get. Let's get. Uh, this is what I want to get into first. I want to get into the originator or some shit. I want to get into Nintendo. Okay. Everybody hating on the Wii U. That's the. That's my problem. Okay. I, I made a, an analogy earlier, and I'm gonna say it so you guys hear it. You know, everybody like Dr. Dre won't drop the detox. Dr. Dre don't want. He needs to drop it ever since 2010 for the chronic. Or whatever, in 2000, it came out in 1999. Like, oh, he needs to drop it. It's 2013, he needs to drop it. And he came out with the Kush song. Everybody swore it was going to drop. I knew the shit wasn't going to drop. Okay, the, he needs to drop it. He ain't need to drop shit. The motherfucker make beats. He makes the beats. He got every artist in the industry making their own type of beats. You got Lil Wayne, the so-called best rapper in the world. <laughs> got his own beats with him. Okay, I'm, I'm just saying. So why do he he innovate shit? He don't need to. He don't need to drop shit. He don't need to drop. Just like I'm telling you guys right now with Nintendo, they don't need to drop shit. Now here goes something with Nintendo. When they drop a game, they drop a game. They mm -hmm. drop a game. You don't have to patch shit. There is no patches to their games. There's they, no DLC. There's no is. DLC. It's perfectly made. DLC, and bro. Xbox, they took a jab at y'all punk asses because y'all wanted to go to Best Buy and hate on their shit. And like, they want to play used game. They want to play used game. You know, Reggie Phil, Amy, he finally done did some shit right and said, if you want your games to not get used and traded and stuff, make, make good quality bad. games. Yep. Make games that nobody want to trade in. Look at this. Look at this. Skies of Arcadia. Look at, look at that Smash Bros. That shit old as dirt. Old as dirt. That's my original copy of Super Smash Bros. Melee. All my Wii games, original copies, okay, or just just flat out. I don't I don't trade those. I, first of all, I don't trade or sell any games, so everything I got is going to probably be an original copy. Now, Sony and Sony and Microsoft need to take notes from Nintendo altogether because even though Super Smash Bros. still is going on up until the Wii U with the newest Smash Bros. game that they got coming out, even the 3DS, 
these games always feel different. They always add something new to it that makes the game that much more fun. Games like Call of Duty or anything like that is always the same. And I keep telling everybody that Battlefield, Call of Duty, it's all the same game every single year. Added maps don't make it better. It doesn't. This is always different. Whether it be the characters, the levels, it always has something that brings you back. It always keeps you going all together. And it's original. It's always original. No. Nothing, nothing different. What I want to get into it for is that when you brought up the... No added stuff. Um, Nintendo does not do DLC. No. Okay. So, Super Smash Brothers, let's get into it. There's hella characters that you can unlock. Mm -hmm. Just like God of War. When you were a good ass gamer, you had to do these special missions to be able to unlock special characters, special armor, special this, special that. You didn't have to pre order shit. You didn't have to pay $10 to do shit in that punk ass season pass. You didn't have to do none of that bullshit. If I want Mewtwo on Super Smash Brothers Melee, my video game system has to play over, I think, 25,000 hours of straight video gaming. Of straight gaming. That is a lot of hours playing just to get a character. But that's how you they want. You want that character, you get it. They're not going to charge me $5 for it. That happened. So I, I cheated. I, yeah, I did. I cheated. I cheated. Yeah, I left my... When I go to work... Leave the system on. Yeah, leave the system on. I, I, tell, I leave the system on every time I go to work. It took me like almost a month to get that shit, but I did. Leave the system on. I left the system on. I leave the system on every time I go to work. It took me like almost a month to get that shit, but I did it. Left the system on. That, that's how you do it. But just like, I like, like you have to go the extra mile to do it. That's what it's all. I about. had to pay five dollars for it. Nope. Just like they're trying to charge me five dollars for Batgirl and Injustice. I'm not gonna pay for that bullshit. And then y'all motherfuckers come out and drop uh, uh, all the characters like you did Mortal Kombat and drop it for thirty dollars with Freddy Krueger and all that shit in there. Let's talk about Nintendo innovating some shit. Okay, everybody hating on Nintendo. What's this right here? Oh shit, it's the Waybird. This came out with the GameCube, the first wireless controller for a console. First wireless controller. Then look at all of a sudden, look like at these late motherfuckers. Y'all late. Y'all late. Y'all late. What Nintendo come out with? What Nintendo come out with after that? Oh, they came out with the um, Nintendo Wii. And they find out. All the mommies and YMCA's and grandmas and stuff wanted to go ahead and buy their for their kids. So what you do, PlayStation and what you do, PlayStation and Xbox, y'all motherfuckers want to come out with your fucking eye cameras and your connects. Don't nobody want that bullshit, y'all. You know what it is? Y'all trying to y'all trying to get these new market people in PlayStation. I kudos to you guys. That's why I love y'all now, right now. Fuck you, Xbox, and don't nobody say I'm a fan, no fanboy shit, cause I got all that shit. Don't say nothing. Fuck you, Xbox. Because y'all y'all not even going towards video game players. You guys are going towards these mothers of America. That's what I'm going to call it. These bitch-ass games. These new gamers. These motherfuckers don't know nothing about no goddamn video games. Yep. Uh, don't know shit about them. They, all they know about is Call of Duty and NBA 2K and, and NBA Live and Madden and shit. They don't know shit about no fucking video games. They're, like Most of these games on the table, they're one-player games anyways. What the fuck do I need to be online to play me a one-player game for? I need to play Dude, that what shit. What you talking about, man? I want to be on live so I can watch Comcast. What you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> no, I sit there. They sitting there biting and shit. And then look at this. Look. And then come on now. Like now, PlayStation, you guys are going to use your PlayStation Vita as your tablet for your PlayStation 4. It's genius. It's, it's, it's genius. It's genius. genius. I don't give a shit. Get the fuck out of here. That's a bite that shit. Y'all knew Nintendo was coming out with their tablet shit. But hey, but why y'all why y'all think y'all why y'all think y'all slick at doing stuff? Nintendo finna hit y'all with some new shit. Why? Just watch. They always do it. They always do it. They always come out, hit y'all with some new shit for y'all biting motherfuckers hey, to go ahead and steal this shit. I know you saying this for about PS Vita. Sony always try to do the remote play. This might actually be the first time it succeeds in doing it right. The fact that it can innovate every single PlayStation 4 game and remote play onto the Vita. Yeah, that is awesome. Yes, they are buying the Wii, but at the same time, I'm glad that they are promoting their uh, handheld that's getting no love whatsoever right now. This shit is falling faster You're than... You're taking notes from a very, very smart company. <laughs> that's all it is. PlayStation Vita. You guys never be Nintendo. I'm sorry. When it comes to the handheld market... No, of course not. You you can't do it because you have to be able to entertain kids. It, mm -hmm. I, like, I'm sorry... But you work, I work, you work. You ain't got time to play the PlayStation Vita. Kids got time to play. The, I mean, unless you ain't got no motherfucking job and you work at GameStop and shit for like two to four hours a fucking week, and then you can play your place. You can play all the games you want to play, or if you ain't got a job, you just play video games all day. You can play whatever the hell you want to play. But other than that, 
if you working all day, you ain't got time for that shit. That's the thing. Uh, and like uh, the um, the beat is gonna attract our audience, but in reality, like the games are just a little bit too violent for the kids, and the parents are gonna say no. That's how, that's just how it's gonna go. So no, you guys are gonna have to make some some games. You're gonna make some kitty well, games. Oh no, I mean, it's kind of hard to say that nowadays too, especially in this time of day where parents actually let kids play Call of Duty all day. Kids don't understand how to play Final Fantasy and shit like that. Though Call of Duty is a little kid game. It's a simple-minded person's game. Matter what about of fact, Grand Theft Auto? exactly. They don't understand Grand Theft Auto yet. No, they that's still parents. Players, though. Yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, that's parents for that one because I don't know how many times I've seen articles and read about parent, you know, little kids playing video games. When in fact, who bought them the game? Was it mom, grandma, dad? But from my for from my experience of working at GameStop, though. You get those parents that come in and be like, oh yeah, he plays it all the time. It's okay. And it's like, you seriously let your kid play this knowing what it's all about? That's terrible. Now, what you want to know is really terrible is EA. But the worst company in America, again. Twice in a row. Twice in a row. <laughs> <laughs> Slick then they finally hand. get that shit right. But yeah, finally they get, get it shit right. right. They dropped the. Uh, they ain't get shit right. No, them slick no, no. bastards didn't get shit right. No, they some slick motherfuckers. They gamed everybody. They pimped everybody. I know. No, I, no, I know where you. Go, I know where you going. I already know where you going with this. Play. They dropped that online pass. That's what you finna get to. No, they gamed everybody. They oh, we dropped the online pass, and all of a sudden they talking about fuck you, Nintendo on Twitter and shit. Okay, you know why I said Nintendo? Why they said fuck you, Nintendo? Because Nintendo plays use games. Okay. Yep. Nintendo plays use games and I can let anybody I want to borrow that shit. That's why. And then they had everybody with a scare as in like PlayStation, are you going to do the same? Because they are. You already know Microsoft, you money hungry motherfuckers. You already know y'all some sellouts. That's all right though. Five years, your system won't be shit. Get ready. Get ready, Dreamcast. Uh, Sega. <laughs> Sega, if you wanna you wanna get back in the market, Sega, it's just about that time because Microsoft oh. won't be able to do shit. Oh look at the witch. Oh. Check this out. Mm. A little bit of detail here. Let's go on Twitter. What's happening? Go ahead, read that. Can you read that? If your account is banned, you also forfeit the licenses to any games that you have licenses tied to as is listed in the TOU. If you don't believe us, this is coming from the website of maxconsole.net. Which is also the legit site to uh, get all your gaming information from. Mm -mm -mm. Xbox. We, we're tired of shit. There you Microsoft. are right there. They fuck yeah. up once again. They can't get their online policy straight. They can't do anything right. What do you mean tell me? I've been kicked off Xbox Live before twice. And, and for some bullshit. For bullshit because I was whooping ass in a video game. Some motherfuckers get mad and report me. And next thing you know... I get this little thing that says you can't get online for two weeks. Yep. What kind of bullshit is that? And that so you mean to tell me that I, I ain't never been kicked first of all, I ain't never been kicked off the PlayStation Network. Okay, but I got kicked off Xbox Live twice. Something I pay for. Pay for I pay sixty dollars a month for it. Why the fuck am I getting kicked off? I ain't just right? I got suspended from a video game. <laughs> right. Let me tell y'all something, Microsoft. I ain't never been suspended in school. I ain't never had detention. I ain't never had OCS. Uh, I ain't never had OCS. I ain't never had none of that shit. <laughs> but I got suspended from a video game system. How in the fuck do that happen? How does that happen? That's some come on now. That's some bullshit. That don't make no damn sense. So that's why exactly why I got me a PlayStation 3 for y'all punk motherfuckers. I ain't getting uh, plus they bring out video games anyways. You guys market to Call of Duty players. You got y'all can have that shit. Call of Duty people you Call of Duty people and you sports playing video game people, y'all can have the Xbox One. That's what y'all can do. I don't want that bullshit. This is but. pretty much what it sums it all right here. Same site says, <laughs> don't like Xbox One? Stick to your Xbox 360. This is coming from the CEO of Microsoft. No, I got the video, actually. Yeah, there's actually a video for it, but I'm just showing you yeah. a quick little demonstration of yeah, that, that. what they say saying to the 360 uh, characters about right. upgrading. He flat out said that. He said, stay to your 360. Yeah, we got something for you. You don't have the internet connection, yep. Yeah, you won't have the internet. It's called the Xbox 360. And then Jeff Keighley was like, for real? Like, you know Jeff Keighley run to get in that motherfucker's ass saying that bullshit. Yep. Like oh, yeah. that. Yeah, come on. Come on, um, you idiot. You PR. Really? Microsoft, where do you hire these idiots? That's what I want to know. God damn, I can't. Come on. 
All right, like, I, I'm not going to see. That's what I'm saying. They got me trained already. I can't even say my job. I'm not even going to do it because I'm on social. But I can't go on Facebook and talk all that bullshit about my job. I'll get fired. Why are y'all not firing these idiots? Why are you guys not firing these? These people, get, y'all fired one person. And that's because he went and snitched on y'all motherfuckers. Because he told about four months ago that you guys were going to do that online 24-7 shit. That's why. And then y'all want to go off and fire him. But come on now. Fire, fire EA. They the ones that snitched. They snitched when they went on Twitter talking shit about the Nintendo. And and and, 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 and Xbox. Y'all got to be feeling real stupid. Because somewhere in the line, you guys, EA and Sony were... Had some kind of talks about that no use game shit. Y'all had talks about that, and then Sony fucked y'all in the ass and said, "This is how you share a game." Okay, so y'all got screwed. <laughs> they fucked y'all, and then they, and then that, not only that, uh, that y'all knew y'all was fit to sell that shit for about almost five to six hundred dollars for a video game fucking system. Y'all knew that shit. So when y'all went on ahead and dropped your little price <laughs> for five hundred dollars, I'm like, oh. You know, crowd they wasn't even happy and all the shit like that. Oh, the Xbox, the dude was sitting there just laughing every time he would say something because he knew that he had you guys on rap here. Yeah, and we cost three hundred and ninety nine dollars. Just they was, they just knew they fucked you guys over. And I, you guys probably had some kind of a deal to try and get Nintendo the fuck out of here. And Sony know that they they got this shit on lock. They know it. Right, they they're fucking with Sony now. I mean, they're fucking with um, Nintendo now because that's the only people they can mess with. They, they go to Best Buy hating on them. Yeah, y'all at Best Buy. They're doing that Nintendo press events. Yeah, that's ridiculous. <laughs> how you go, how you send people Look, from Microsoft? Video game players, video game players at Best Buy just trying to play the fucking video game. They ain't trying to play Call of Duty. They playing Mario Kart and playing Zelda and mm-hmm. shit like that. And here you motherfuckers want to come and promote Call of Duty and shit. Don't nobody want to play that bullshit. Don't nobody want to play Call of Duty but these these simple-minded people and these kids. You guys are simple. You guys that play Call of Duty, I swear to God, y'all simple-minded. That's yeah. called desperation, really. Yeah, like, you you guys are not somebody gamers. Somebody from Microsoft going uh-huh. over to a Nintendo event talking about why are you playing the Wii U when the Xbox One is just right around the corner. I'm mad as fuck that you guys like honestly think that you're gamers. You're not gamers. You guys don't know shit about video games. You Call of Duty, 2K, Madden players. Y'all don't know shit. Y'all buy these systems just to just to play that. Well, LeBron okay. James is on the cover. Oh my God, he looks so real. <laughs> no, I don't care. Like, fuck, I know LeBron James. Nigga ain't giving me no money. That's down. Like, I, don't, I don't give a shit about LeBron James. He didn't do shit in the last game. Uh, uh, yeah, he didn't. Dwayne Wade. I, I can't. Spurs going win anyways. I don't give a shit. Yep. That's how I feel about it. Let's get about. Let's get on. Let's get on this dude right here. While we, before we get back into this Microsoft bashing, because I'm bashing them motherfuckers. Oh shit. Okay, that. Was a great ass movie. Look at this wallet. Look at that man of steel. Look at that. Shit's clean. Shit's clean. Now, okay. Sean, I gotta say this. I'm a Spider Man fan, but when I saw the movie, hands down, I gotta go see it again in the movie theater because it was. Oh, yeah, that's definitely a movie I'll oh, definitely shit. see again. It is. And then even buy it as 3D. I will have it on 3D. That's a death must. It's a great ass movie, and I'm going to go see it tomorrow night again in 3D. Um, some of you guys just like, oh, I like Superman, cause Superman. Nah, nah, nah. Don't base don't base this movie on the last movies. I'm the biggest Superman fan, you know, and I'll just flat out tell you the last movie that came out was Sorry. I can't if you try and ask me a scene in that movie, I couldn't tell you. The only thing I could remind remember to tell you is that he got shot in the eye, I guess, with one of those bullets and it ricocheted off of him. He got beat up by Harold and Kumar in the movie. He chased the Mustang. <laughs> <laughs> he, did. he got chased by he got, he chased the ugly bitch from uh what's what's that movie? Uh, Blade, he chased that bitch that was in the uh, in the Mustang and because the brakes were gone and that and from Lex Luthor. The movie sucked. That was a horrible ass movie. I, I, I don't even I own it because I'm a Superman fan. I, I wanted to watch it last night just to like hurt my own feelings. Somebody needs to burn that burn that whole production down. Just like the the Hulk, not the Incredible Hulk, but the Hulk one where he's fighting this elements of his father. That was it's hor- horrible. Horrible. Not a horrible movie. No. Man of Steel is the, is the second greatest movie I have seen when it comes to to um, the movie that got that mm-hmm. 50, 10, 50, uh, it's 10, Man of Steel is, is the second greatest I'm still going Dark Knight um, based off the Joker 
Uh, and I, like it, if it wasn't from Heath Ledger, I, Man of Steel would be my number one. So it goes Dark Knight, Man of Steel, The Amazing Spider-Man. Um, I'm sorry, women, okay, and you non-comic people, but The Avengers is not that high up there. You guys, once again, simple-minded. You you think you know the comics and you don't know shit. Sorry about that. Um, Spider-Man co- followed the most with the comic. Mm-hmm. It's high up there. The Dark Knight, it didn't have to follow a comic. The shit was, that's why it's number one. It was just so fucking perfect. So perfect that, I mean, Joker menaced the fuck out of Batman. That's just how it goes. And then he got Superman, which, like, like instead of them doing what everybody thought that could have, because I, I thought it was going to happen too, and I was like, please don't do this. Instead of them doing, like, a whole timeline from the beginning to the end, as in, like, him growing up from um, being a baby in Krypton and growing up on the farm and all that stuff, they, as soon as he left Krypton, the action started. The shit started from him being Kal El, Clark, Joe, and all kind of names he done had that he was lying about. Okay, he he did that, and then they tied in his childhood parts throughout the whole movie. Doing the flashbacks. Doing the flashbacks. It was perfect. It had great images of like of life in it. Um, I can't wait till the new one comes out. And then, um, as long as you guys plan on doing the Justice League. And if I, I don't care how much I love Superman, he's a great person, and The Dark Knight was great. I swear to God, I will not watch. I will not watch Justice League if Ryan Reynolds is in that movie. The Green Lantern, no, oh, I have him back. Uh, no, you can have you can have Green Lantern in there. I won't watch the Justice League if Ryan Reynolds is in that movie. I'm never watching another Ryan Reynolds movie in my life ever again. What he's a sorry ass actor. Reeves in it? I'll watch <laughs> Keanu Reeves. I watch that movie. I'm not Ryan Reynolds is the worst actor of all time, of all time. No, bring in the black Green Lantern. Bring in how? Bring in how? Yeah, Jordan. Bring in anybody? I don't care. You can bring them all in. I I don't I don't care at all. I I just don't like Ryan Reynolds. He's a horrible actor. Horrible. I don't, I don't know how that. How anybody? Why he failed college for acting? Look that shit up. I'm not. I'm not exaggerating this. He got a D in acting when he was in college, but he's an actor. Okay, just just saying. I'm just saying. So somebody knew. Somebody knew something that he should have known. Okay, he's a horrible actor. He sucks. Should have seen. Well, look at look at him in Blade. Blade Trinity. He was actually in that movie. Yeah, I forgot he was in it, and I watched it. Again. <laughs> Here's my gripe though: the fact that they're actually doing a Deadpool movie and yeah, he's playing Deadpool. No, he really he's really playing Deadpool. Yeah, he's playing Deadpool. He was Deadpool in the yeah, I know that. He was, there. Yeah, but and I mean, they're making a movie based off of him with Ryan Reynolds. But as he wasn't that big of a character, honestly. And the fact that they shut his mouth up and he and was it, terrible. Perfect. It don't matter now. I don't think it's terrible. It just I don't want to see him act. Period. It's just flat out. He can't act. Don't don't let him act. So when they shut his mouth up, it was cool. They kept that movie based upon Wolverine, and that's the way I like it. No, no, um, no. Ryan Reynolds. You need his ass beat. Sorry, ass actor. Weak. Worst actor of all time. And then um, Tracy Morgan. You're a sellout. Worst and you're sorry. Comedian yeah. ever. Yeah. Besides Cat Williams. But yeah. Nah, uh, I, 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 I listen to Cat Williams, Williams any day. Tracy Morgan. Yeah. That's all I hear. I, I, the, this is America. I, the, the movie. <laughs> the the movie Rio. Well, I, I was feeling the movie. The movie was great. It was great. Now, all of a sudden, here come his bitch ass in that bulldog. Like, oh, man, fuck the movie up. Fuck the movie up, Tracy Morgan. It's garbage. What we finna attack on these systems again? Let's attack at Nintendo, you motherfuckers. I I, I I know I was giving y'all a lot of kudos, but I'm finna get y'all ass too, Nintendo. I'm finna get y'all ass. Over here. Bring in some motherfucking games. God damn. Can I buy a game? I ain't bought a Wii U game since I don't know when. Like the second month it was released. <laughs> what the fuck I buy it? I don't <laughs> I even know. Shit. Armored edition. Can I can I can I spend some money on you guys? God damn. Y'all like y'all like me having a, a girlfriend in prison. And I can't spend no money on her. That's what y'all like. And I just see. <laughs> That's more like can't get a conjugal. <laughs> can I get a conjugal or something? God damn, I can't do shit with you. Can't do shit. Can I get a game? I know Injustice came out on y'all, but why the fuck would I buy Injustice on the Wii U 
When you when I gotta have a friend code to play with people. Nintendo fix that fucking shit. What the fuck I need a friend code for? <laughs> God damn. This ain't to, to catch a predator and shit. It's a fucking video game system. <laughs> I should be able to just look at whoever the fuck I want to and then be a friend on, on the game and we play the game. I gotta I gotta text. I gotta text who I want to be my friend and get their friend code, enter that shit in on there to be their friend on Damn, I didn't realize it's that bad. It's, it's mm-hmm. that bad. Yeah. Nintendo, please, like, do something about that shit. Bro, keep Nintendo right now. Bro, <laughs> need y'all ass. Y'all need y'all ass big. Re- Reggie, Phil, Amy, nah, you you need your ass beat too, motherfucker. That that shit don't make no damn sense. How I gotta text somebody else to get a friend code from them just to play a fucking video game online. That's why I don't have injustice for y'all. That's why I, I, I want to buy Watch Dogs. I don't play multiplayer games anyways, so I might buy Ju- Watch Dogs. I, that if I get the game because I don't even want the game. But if I get the game, then I'll probably buy it for the Wii U, just for the uh, single player par- portion of it, just to support it. And hopefully, you guys come and hurry up and bring out some fucking games. God damn. Yeah, last time I checked, Nintendo's losing steam because all their developers are leaving because they ain't making shit. They can't make a fucking game. But the only problem is, it's like a double edged sword. Like, nobody wants to make games for them, but at the same time, the system ain't selling because of the no games. They're kind of going the same route that they did with the original Wii, that's why. Y'all need to stop focusing on these little kids and these YMCA moms and make some motherfucking video games. Okay, look at what happened with the GameCube. I, I'm just it sold millions. Why? They had games. So did the mm-hmm. Nintendo 64 before that too. Yeah, I just Nintendo 64. Man, I can't even. I can't even pronounce how many fucking games I have for the Nintendo 64. <laughs> it's just, just all kind of games. A great ass system though. Uh, the, the I'm say, I skipped that one. Got the PS One. I, I had the PS One too. I had all. Do you not realize how many multiplayer games that I played on the Nintendo sixty four? Starting with Golden Eye, Perfect Dark, Golden Eye, what? Innovators, Perfect Dark, Innovators. Holy shit! Innovators. Here it goes. Four Banjo. controllers. Yep. Four controllers. First system to do it. But you know what the funny part about it is? All those systems, all those games you just named, were made by Rare. And Rare is now owned by Microsoft. We don't make shit for them, but damn Connect games. Mm-hmm. But what's funny is how what's Nintendo doing now? Do they still have the rights to Donkey Kong? Yeah, because Donkey yeah. Kong was done by Rare too. Yeah, that's the only thing they let them have. Yeah, they still got it. Out of all the Rare games, that's the only thing Nintendo physically owns is Donkey Kong. That's good for Nintendo, at least. Yeah, but they ain't doing nothing with it. It's nice to have an IP, but if you can't do nothing with it, the they release. actually they they do. They're, they're making it. Awesome. They're, yeah, they're yeah. making one for the Wii U, and then they just dropped the game for the 3DS. Well, they need to release that shit then for the Wii, Wii U version at least. Yeah. yeah. Um, some games I like to see on the Wii U that were on the PlayStation or the Xbox that just recently came out yeah, or so, the, or that the, that you guys could bring out. <laughs> um, since the PlayStation has Castle Crashers and Xbox has it, Xbox had it first, and then PlayStation U5 has finally got it, you late motherfuckers. Go ahead, throw that shit on the Wii U. I'll spend ten dollars on it. Okay. Castle Crashers. Oh no! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh, yeah. Castle Crashers. Can you imagine shit. Scott Pilgrim versus the World and being able to uh, use that controller that for your game. inventory? That would have been a perfect game to go on the Wii U. Right. Like, Even the on. Wii. Like, well, no, I said the Wii U because Wii, Wii U has U. a better online system. Bring some shit like this back. Y'all, come on. And the thing about it is, it's not like we don't have games here in America. Because I know y'all motherfuckers is hiding all the good games in Japan. Okay, It's all Reggie Phil, Phil and me. It's all him. He's the one that's not letting a lot of this shit come through. Come bring that shit to America, man. Y'all got all the good. I got that. Orochi's or Orono. I can't even pronounce it. I got it for the Wii U, though. That's the, that's or is it Orochi? Yeah, that's the only game I got. Who said Roaches? <laughs> I don't even know. Okay. <laughs> y'all motherfuckers didn't even get Tomb Raider. You know what Tomb Raider could have looked like if y'all had that on the Wii U pad? I would have been sick. That would have been a good look right there. Yeah. My it would God. Be beautiful. You guys, come on. Then. You guys, didn't Nintendo, didn't the GameCube, wasn't the GameCube the one that started this shit right here? The Tales of, uh, of, uh, Symphonia. yeah, y'all started that shit. Mm-hmm. So why in the fuck is PlayStation owning that now? Come, come Actually, on. Actually, Xbox had the Tales of Vesperia. Uh, I Xbox. But yeah. it, it didn't sell very well on the Xbox. Yeah, because that's because name, name, name three games. name three Xbox RPGs. Yeah. Tales of Vesperia, Lost Odyssey, 
and Final Fantasy 13, which Final all Fantasy three that's all us on both systems. It got to be straight exclusive. exclusive. Straight exclusive. Tells, okay, well then the first two is the only two I know of as exclusive. What's it what, when the when this um, system first came out? I can't remember the damn the game. I had it too. I let I let this do. And oh, Blue Dragon. Blue Dragon. That's the one. That's it. That's all y'all motherfuckers got. God damn it! How how long ago was that? They're not an RPG system. They're not an RPG company. Yeah, they're not fucking anything. Y'all don't play video games. That's what it is. <laughs> you I'm motherfuckers more. that support the system don't play video games. And that's why they're doing y'all like that. That's why they're trying to do gamers like that. Trying without all his online shit. Fuck, fuck that. That don't make no goddamn sense. I can't take my system over on my homeboy's house that ain't got internet and play my fucking video game. Oh, that's all right here, right? That's how you it's can't. Broken down. Oh. Hello. Oh, oh, oh this is wild. Okay, I dropped my phone, but it's cool. All right, let's do that. You can't do shit. You just say you can't do shit. You can't win games. You can't win games. You can't trade a game. You, only pre-approved retailers can accept your trade-ins. No independent game shops. <laughs> no independent game shops. Since there is less competition, you get less trade-in credit of course sell games freely in order to sell a game to someone you must have their friends with them for over 30 days you have to be friends with somebody for let me tell y'all something xbox you motherfuckers you go out on a date with a girl when you first <laughs> meet them guys whole goal is to get in them draws i'm just telling y'all that right now yeah okay. um the ladies just know that and honesty um if most guys, just I'm probably going to say 85% of the guys and 90%, they don't get in them draws in 30 days, they don't want shit to do with that girl no more. Okay? I'm just saying, like, 30 days is a long-ass motherfucking shit, time. Shit, week is pushing it. What you talking uh, about? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so basically what I'm saying is girls put out quicker than 30 days. So why the fuck do I need to be somebody's friend on, on, on a fucking video game console for 30 days just for them to share my game? Be my friend. That's be my friend, please. What if you got? What if somebody got mad at you and they they was like, "I'll cut your motherfucking ass off on day twenty nine, you motherfucker." <laughs> what if they did that shit? Get That's some fuck fucking games here. right there. You don't see Call of Duty on there. You don't see no shooters on there. You see uh, RPG. Actually, that's two RPGs. That's a strategy game though, and adventure. Two adventure games. A basic. You know, fun ass game all together, a racer, a fighter, two fighters at that, and another adventure game that just came out. Ain't no Call of Duty on there, ain't, ain't no Madden. Damn, I just brought my movie over here. I'm just Those some goddamn games. Yeah. Some video games. Like, like I ain't done shit. Kinda hold this. Hold this. I'm gonna show y'all some motherfucking video games. Yep. Show y'all some video games. I'm gonna bring out my Nintendo 3DS. Cause they make video games. Video games. This is what they do. I'm gonna bring out my 3DS games. Just bring these out. Watch this shit. These are video games, you guys. Nobody plays fucking Call of Duty. And, uh, like, Microsoft, get that shit fucking together. Watch this. I'm going to put it on there. Mm -hmm. Advanced Wars. What do you yep. know about that? What do you what, do, what do you guys that do? You guys that don't play video games. What do you know about that? Mm -hmm. That's a great-ass fucking game. Strategy. Use yep. your brain. Yep. Look at that. Another Advanced Wars. Ooh. Another one. Look at that. Okay, just got them all day. Mm -hmm. Hi, man. Hold on. we we'll come out with them. Oh, video game. Hold on. Go to Sprouts. Boom. Video game. Pokemon, I baby. Fuck how much y'all could. Pokemon's a kick game. No, Pokemon's a fun ass game. That's what Pokemon is, nigga. That takes strategy and skill to be able to play that shit. Pokemon's a fun and, ass game. And patience, actually. Punk ass, man. I'm tired of that shit. I, man, I, can't man, I, got, tri I got tricked by a GameStop employee for buying that. That's a bullshit game. I don't even know what it is, but I would play that over Madden. Now, let's see. Uh, I, for all, everybody who buys Madden. Y'all yeah. some stupid yeah. fuckers. Rare, rare ass game. Touch the dead. Mm -hmm. That's a shooting game, but it's a video game because it actually has a story mode to it that makes you want to play. It's a great game, and you can't say that that the the 3ds don't bring out mature type games. They bring out mature games. Okay, they bring out T games. Little Red Zombie. What is this? Uh, Little Red. Riding Hood Zombie Barbecue. Don't let the name fool you for this game. This is a great ass game. It's fun and addictive, and it, it is like one of those little shooting games. It's a great ass game. It's a video game. I don't know shit about Code of Princess, okay? That's a good ass fucking game. Good ass game. Great story mode to it. 
It's gonna be a rare game too. Fire Emblem. Strategy mm -hmm. War. Beautiful game. Another rare, rare game. Look at that. These video games. You ain't gonna see no magnet here. K and Chris. Mm-hmm. Good ass game. Fucking call it, dude. You don't play that bullshit. Kingdom Hearts. Kingdom Hearts. Luigi's Mansion. Mario Kart 7. Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Just shit like that. And I have more games, but I got Jack. One of them little kids at my job. Jack my ass. I had like 20 of them games. They got me, though. Shame. <laughs> you know, tell you that right motherfuckers don't know shit about no damn video games, man. Nope. Don't know shit. But y'all, come on now, but y'all wanna. Y'all, y'all wanna, y'all wanna ride with the Xbox 720 or whatever that shit is, Xbox One. <laughs> y'all know what? I got an Xbox One. I got an Xbox One. Hold this. Hold this. I got an Xbox One already. I ain't even got a pre-order shit. I got an Xbox One. Yeah, <laughs> Microsoft's over here fucking up. They can't do shit. I know you saw that post talking about PlayStation's also got one 13 years ago. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> I was also laughing. Uh, this right here One of the family dogs She a straight parent It was funny Yeah According to uh, Amazon Straight parent <laughs> Ain't that right Jazzy According to Amazon Jazzy B Straight parent PS4 17 yeah. Xbox 1 and That's the ratio Of what it is right now It's like 17 to 1 Isn't it it's 17 to 1 Plus Yeah PS4 is getting Ooh. outsold Ooh, running. Look at this It got, some, got a little dust on it I'll play it Oh it's fun. Okay, this is the first original Xbox one. Xbox One. That's the one that people were controller. complaining about how big it was. Actually, I love that controller. I really. love this controller. Yeah, because I got big hands. Don't bother mm -hmm. me. Hell yeah. Whooping Remember my ass. first game was Mech Assault. That's Whooping shit. ass. That was a ass good ass game. Whooping ass and Halo. Okay, that's okay, Xbox. Let me get that one more time. Yeah. Reminiscent. Oh, Xbox shit. One. <laughs> yeah, okay. I, love this I got every mm -hmm. system. Every system. I have it all. I got yeah. a system. I don't nobody say nothing about no fanboy shit. Okay. Mm. Well, I love this shit. What's yeah, up? What's up? PS3. I mean, <laughs> 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 actually, oh, my. actually, I did have a converter where you could play um, Xbox controllers on the PlayStation two, um, One or mm -hmm. PlayStation Two, and um, you could play PlayStation Two controllers on the Xbox oh, and the game. What kind of connector does that? Um, I oh. can't. Well, that's one of those basic uh, original Xbox ones, the round oval shaped ones. Damn. Yeah. That's old school. If I actually can get a USB connector for this, I will be playing just like this. Yep. You can, there's um, just the computer ones. I remember I had that. Yeah, but they're hard to find. Yeah. All I want is Nintendo. All I want is you guys to release some games. Please make some games. Please. This gen okay. is all about Nintendo and PS4. Basically. Uh, There's only two systems you can go what to. What is an Xbox? I'd be forgetting you guys sometimes, what, what you guys are. Like, honestly. We're done with you, Xbox. Um, yeah, Holly way, man, boy. You lost one. Uh, There's a way you can get me back. There's still, I, 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 I'm setting the ultimatum now. Okay, I was easy, but now I'm not easy no more. Um, so now there's a way you can get me back, and I'm not um, taking no, no for an answer. One is, um, I want to play used games. Okay. I don't give a fuck. Like, if I don't want, I don't feel like I need to pay full price for a fucking video game. The game already got sold, you cheap bastards. The game already got sold. You already got the just money like, for it. Just Why like not? EA. They're double dipping. That's what you it got is. Double dipping it. Come on now. That's some bullshit. Double okay. dipping. Wow. That's bullshit. The game already got sold. You got your money for it. I can do whatever I want to for it. Okay. That's yep. it. Next one is I should be able to play. I should be able to play a video game whenever the fuck I want to, and however in the fuck I want to. Okay, we play sixty dollars for a fucking video game, and it don't even. Oh, mommy wants some want haircut. Don't make no sense. <laughs> I want to share that. Um, and then I also want you motherfuckers um, to lower that price. Yeah, why the hell we got a mandatory connect, and I don't even want connect. Not, I don't. I'm a video game player. I don't need to connect. Yeah, why the hell? Are they, I'm gonna be playing some damn Dance Dance Revolution the whole time. Fuck right, that. I play video games. You can't even turn the bitch off. Yeah. All right. Give me a controller. I want a controller. <laughs> I'm so glad Nintendo went. I don't care how big that fucking pad is. It's a controller. It is a controller. I want a controller. I don't want no none of that bullshit. 
Oh, hands, please. Yeah. yeah. Video game players use controllers. That's what you used to. The hands are molded to them. Xbox, I'm so disappointed. You guys got the best controller ever. Honestly, to tell you the truth, this is the best controller I've ever felt in my life. The the Wayberg. Yeah, you guys are <laughs> Let me check out this first wireless controller here. Yeah. You guys are like Yeah. You guys are second in line when it comes to the best feeling controller. Um, so to sum shit up, we're tired of your shit Xbox. Microsoft. Yeah, fix your D pad. Fix all that shit. <laughs> uh, I got something like that fixed where you can do a little turn a little on swivel. Yeah. That don't work for this shit. is stupid. That's stupid. Who, uh, you just one more thing real quick to speculate in the show how much of gamers we are. No nigga that plays Call of Duty plays this. And I got some PC gaming as well. These are MMOs, people. These are multi. These are pretty much massive multiplayer online games. Massive multiplayer online. Now, people for Call of Duty are what used to playing what sixteen versus sixteen? Yeah. Or is it eight, eight versus eight? Eight, eight versus eight. If that, if they don't get lag out. Sky's the limit on the amount of people that you can play with. Now, people be whining like a bitch on these games. I'm not gonna lie. They said that they cry because stuff don't go their way. But these are these are fun, some fun ass games. Oh yeah! If you can, if you have time, people who don't have jobs or people that pretty much, <laughs> I don't care. Job. If you got the time and the patience, play these games. They're good. They're fun. You ain't got to buy Diablo on PC. It's coming out for the PlayStation Four. Exactly. How you doing? <laughs> uh, just saying. No. And Xbox. Ooh, I ain't done ripping you, y'all motherfuckers yet. I thought it was over. Y'all motherfuckers. You know, was at E3 showing your systems off with the Windows, with the PC. Oh. What the fuck? Yeah, I, what I, the I, fuck? I don't get that. What the fuck is wrong with it? And y'all was sitting there, and, and people was wondering why your Xbox controller wasn't working because they were. You guys, motherfuckers, weren't even using your own system. You know, it's a piece of shit. Y'all know that system. Y'all know the system is a piece of shit already. Yeah. And then y'all, come on now. Oh, did you also hear about this one? Uh, the makers of Witcher are also pissed off right now because they just found out that they can't even play their own game in Poland. Their makers and developers of their own oh, game can't even play their own game. That ain't in it. 21, 21 states won't be able to play. 21 countries. No, no states in the, in the United States. 21, 21 st states? Yeah, won't be able to play when the game drops. When the game drops. Um, November, whatever. Twenty-one states won't be able to play in the United States, Damn. and a lot of it's in the Midwest. So you basically have to be in the big cities to be able to play your your Xbox One. So um, Xbox, y'all sound stupid as fuck from the get go. Pretty much, stupid. their main supplier is the U.S. because they can't have anything outside the U.S. because they're. It's run by PlayStation and Nintendo. Yeah, that's stupid. Japan's laughing at the niggas right now. They still trying yeah. to put an effort into Japan. They should just leave it alone. Because they can't do anything over there. Go ahead. Yeah. Strictly Nintendo first, Sony after. Exactly. Y'all yeah, stupid. That's how I feel about y'all Microsoft. Let's get using the fucking PC to play your video games in their line. And they, come on now, you know people got cameras these days. You're going to get busted. Stupid. Uh, like, uh... I'm disappointed. That's what I am, and it's, it's something I actually love so much. That like you can't, I can't, I can't even fuck with y'all. Can't even do it, cause y'all want to sit there and y'all want to try and fuck me in the ass. I ain't getting screwed in the ass. It's not happening by no damn system. It's supposed to be video games. There ain't no damn video games. Y'all don't play no video games anyways. Playing Madden and shit and Call of Duty. And if anybody tell me anyway. Oh, what you know about 2K? The first thing I say is it's not a fucking video game. I don't play that. When I say when I say I'm playing my PlayStation, I'm playing a video game. I got Injustice right now in my video game, in my PlayStation. The definition right of a video game is something you don't normally do in the real world. My last game I played on Xbox 360 is State of Decay, and the game just came out, so I don't want nobody saying that and I don't George, play do my 360. You see me at about a good 500 miles per hour. Yeah. No, are, am I one big blue hedgehog? <laughs> I don't have to bend, but no. <laughs> no, I'm not. I can't go web swinging through the entire giant city. I can't fly. I'm not gonna do any of that shit. But you know what I can do? I can play a video game that allows me to do all that. Yeah, that's what video games are meant for. Something you can't do. 
Madden, take your ass out to the field. <laughs> NBA, hey. go to a fucking court. Hey, 24 man. hours got plenty of them. See, when we were growing up, man, back in our day, there wasn't no fuck. I mean, there was Madden, but if we really wanted to play Madden, we'd go outside and play football. Yep. If we want to play basketball, we'd go outside on the court, hoop it up. Exactly. Video games nowadays are making people lazy. I'm too independent of a dude to be riding another man's nuts nope. flat out. That's just how I feel. I've never been a groupie. Um, Kobe Bryant is one of my favorite basketball players in the world. But I can tell you right now, if he walked past me, I would never ask him for his autograph. If you want to give it to me, I'll take it. I won't. I won't deny him. But I'll also take a little kid's autograph at my school I work at, too. I'm just saying. I, I just don't feel like no other person is greater than me. So why in the fuck do I want his autograph? That's just how I feel. I've never been a groupie. But Serena Williams, you can get the business. All right, but... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, any any last follow-ups y'all want to get yeah. in on? This was for Microsoft. That's what I got to say right there. I, I got to go in on this right here, too. Microsoft, two middle fingers up. This is coming from a guy who had pretty much every single system, including the Xbox One. You were Xbox Strong. Xbox Strong, 10 years plus on Xbox Live, all right? Now, now they fucked up with the real gamers and they said, fuck you. If you don't want it, stick with the 360. So I'm doing this to you. They already did that to you. No, they didn't. They already did that to you <laughs> by saying you can't buy our Xbox One. Stick to your Xbox oh, 360. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and it's not that the fact that I don't have internet because I have a 32 gig download and a 5 gig upload. So that's not even the case. I'm just basing it on principles. They're pretty much saying I can't have the right to my own game that I bought the physical copy to. If I want to, like you said, game start receipts. <laughs> if I want to take it somewhere, I have to be contacting mother at least once every 24 hours. If not, I can't play my games at all. What kind of shit is that? GameStop, this should be scaring the fuck out of you guys. Now, you guys might be one of those people that Microsoft buys out. I'm talking about uh, you guys could be one of the retailers that allow the trainings of our games. But, guess what? You guys are some greedy motherfuckers. Just like Microsoft. And I'm going to just put it to you like this. If you guys don't go with that deal, you guys are gone within the next three to five years. Guarantee it. Bankrupt. Because you guys ain't going to be able to sell shit. If you guys are going to sit here and support pretty much a, a company that's not going to be able to support you, then what's the point? That's all I got to say about GameStop before I close it up. Long road GameStop. When you see me walk in with my black hoodie, just know I'm canceling on some one of y'all motherfuckers. Jared and Jeremy, you're safe.